Experience College. You are listening to the Competitor's Brain. This is Lauren Fox, and this is episode number 63. So Anson Dorrance, the legendary coach at the University of North Carolina, is retiring uh, after decades on the program, almost two dozen uh, uh, NCAA championships, um, the most championships of any coach in any program. So uh, truly a storied career, but he had some core values that helped him build the program. Number one, we don't whine. Number two, the truly extraordinary do something every day. Number three, and he says, and we want these four years of college to be rich, valuable, and deep. This is that focused individual that is here for the right reason to get an education. She leads her life here with the proper balance and an orientation toward her intellectual growth and against the highest public standards and most noble universal ideals, she makes good choices to best represent herself, her team, and her university. This quote comes from Reynolds Price. College is about books, and by the word books, the proposition means this. College is about the best available tools, books, computers, lab equipment for broadening your mastery of one or more important subjects that will go on deepening your understanding of the world, yourself, and the people around you. This will almost certainly be the last time in your life when other people bear the expense of awarding you four years of financially unburdened time. I'm going to repeat that. This will almost certainly be the last time in your life when other people bear the expense of awarding you four years of financially unburdened time. It means that you have four years of school to become a better person without paying for it. It doesn't cost you generally. Yeah, it might cost you student loans, but you're not responsible for generating a significant income to cover things like rent or to cover things like raising a family or a mortgage. If you use the years primarily for mastering the skills of social life as though those skills shouldn't have always, as though those skills shouldn't already have been acquired by the end of middle school, or if you use these years for testing the degree to which your vulnerable brain and body can bear the strains of the alcoholism with which a number of students depart campus or the sexual excess that can seem so rewarding to name only two of the lurking maelstroms, then you may ultimately leave this vast table of nutriment as the one more prematurely burnt out case. So going back to the original core value, we want these four years of college to be rich, valuable, and deep. Use the college experience that you have for the right things, not for the wrong things. I can tell you this from experience. I had a lot of fun in college. However, I could have used my five years in college, and I yes, I said five years. I could have used my five years in college to do many better things, ultimately, that would have bettered me in the long run than the short-term gains that I garnered during that time.